first of its kind electric assisted pedal kayak came to Kipling today. It was the only stop in Michigan for the power to the people EPDL kayak tour. TV6's Escanaba Bureau reporter Barbara Bellinger took to the kayak for a spin and spoke to tour organizers about what makes this kayak so unique. Kayakers looking for a new ride cruised around Little Bay de Noc in Kipling today, but instead of paddling, they pedaled and motored along the shore. Blades Bait and Tackle, an old-time canoe and kayak, were demonstrating the latest evolution of motorized kayaks. It's actually going to get released to this next January 2024, but we're on a demo tour talking about it and getting people in the boat so they kind of get an understanding of it before everything freezes up. Tulowitzki says the Old Town Canoe and Kayak Big Water EPDL kayak operates similar to an electric bicycle. They're pedaling and then the motor is built into the drive. It kicks in and gives an assist, okay. so it helps the pedaling, so it reduces the effort. And if a kayaker wants to take a break from pedaling? Most people have cruise control in their cars, but so does the new Big Water EPDL. Right now I'm pedaling, now I'm on cruise control. Noah Johnson tried out the EPDL for the first time. He says he was surprised at how secure he felt in the boat. Just saw uh, how, how good it handled the waves. It's, it's a little windy out here on Little Bay to Knock, and it, it handled them good, and the cruise control is nice, too. Johnson thinks the EPDL kayak would be great for fishing. It'd be good for trolling for walleyes, um, or just being out here on a nice sunny day like today. The boat has five speeds. At its top speed, the boat runs at around five miles per hour. Barbara Ballinger, TV6 News, Kipling.